Hi guys, it's Malik again with a new video. Today you will find out how to set up Windows 11 without a Microsoft account and replace the Microsoft account with a local account. And so, to disable a Microsoft account, click the button, Start, then Open, Settings. In this window, click Accounts. And here we see that my Windows is managed by a Microsoft account and my login is the Outlook email address. A little lower is the tab, your data, click on it. Here we see, sign in with local account instead. To remove the Microsoft account from this Windows, click on it. In this window, the program warns us that when you disable your Microsoft account, some Windows settings will no longer work. For example, syncing your computer with other devices using your Microsoft account. For me, this is not so important because after switching to a local account, all my files, programs, and your personal Windows settings will remain the same. And I click Next. You need to enter your Microsoft account password here. OK. In this window, you need to enter the name of the new account and the new password. And if you don't want to enter your password on the lock screen every time you turn on your computer, then leave the password fields blank and your computer will immediately log into Windows. I don't want to leave my computer unprotected and will enter a new password. Now you need to enter the password again. This is where I need to enter a password hint in case I forget my password. Click Next. There is one last step left before disabling your Microsoft account. You need to make sure you save your work all applications are closed and then you can finish this process. I click Sign Out. The lock screen opens and here we see the name of my new local account. I enter my PIN and here I am logged into Windows under a local account. Now you will learn how to add a Microsoft account in Windows if you want to do so. Click the button Start then Open Settings. In this window, click Accounts. Andy, here we see that my Windows is managed by a local account. Now open the tab, Your Data. Here we see, Sign in with a Microsoft account instead, click on it. This window will ask you to enter your Microsoft account details, or you can click here and create a new Microsoft account. I enter my Microsoft account information. Next. Now you need to enter your Microsoft account password. Sign in. In the window that opens, you need to enter the password of the local account that you created earlier. Next. The last step remains, and here you need to enter your PIN code. Next. Enter your PIN code. The process is complete and my Windows is again managed by a Microsoft account. If you have any questions or suggestions, leave them below and if it was useful for you, please share this video with your friends, like the video and subscribe to my channel. Good luck!